Well, hello and good morning. <laughs> oh, autumn's here. The leaves are falling off the trees, it's blowing a gale. There's not too heavy a rain, there's certainly damp in the air. Um, it's a Saturday, Saturday the 7th of October 2017. Nearly 20 to 7 in the morning, still British summer time. I don't know. It feels, and I think I'm strange here, it feels Christmassy. So the plan, uh, haircut, so that means kafili. Um, the West Woods Beer Festival starts on Wednesday, Wednesday the 11th of October. So I'm popping the Malcolm up hill, and then into Cardiff, and if the weather's nice, Pipes Brewery doing an October fest sort of thing. If it's not so nice, uh, St Canna's. And then Mad Dog's Bottle Shop. That's my plan anyway. It may change. In the day in tech history, I have a feeling you may be gone. And I'm a Patreon. Anyway, Alison Sheridan's on the Daily Tech News show today. I wish to break a leg. It's sort of a podcast thing now. There's Clive opening up. Anyway, here's the spooky thing. So I have a bacon roll without a secret again, Costa. And the lion is feeding me, saying it deserves better. Yep. No cheese, cheese. So I said, will you? Is it not far away? And I said, yes. Come up and ask for Duncan. So, post haircut, off that way. Well, I'm no expert, but I recognise the van. And I recognise the doodling and 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 the rain's nearly stopped, which is good news. Right, it's great. And it's great welcome. Anyway, this was the strawberry grisette. I think he said 3.8, 3.9. It's nice and cold. It smells... smells Belgian. It's got that sort of... sour, lambic, earthy, saison-y. Okay, it's sharp. I wouldn't be surprised if it's Belgian yeast got a bubble gum sort of taste into it. And the, the strawberries just come out near the end. Um, and then you take another sip and it's slightly different. Now this might be just be because I'm having a cold, having a cold, got a cold. Subtle. Bitter acidic finish. Oh, everything's in there, B++. This is excellent. Okay, this says no beers except guide beers. Beers and kafili. So, over here, I'm on the small beer cryo hop. And wow, 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 wow. It's only 3.2% alcohol by volume, but there's a huge fruity hop aroma. And it, it's so different. And to those people who say 3.2% oh, uh, piss water, you need to try this. It is incredibly different. It's fruity, it's hoppy, it's wonderful. Another B. Oh wow. It's still raining, so I might have to shelter here for some time. Apparently, they have bottles as well. Things just keep getting better and better. There's a power socket. This is their black currant oak, 4.5% alcohol by volume. It's sedimented. Apparently they used a whole lot of black currant. I'll say. Okay, so here we go. It's a sour. It smells wonderful. Okay, note. This is not for the beginner. You have to like your sours. Oh. Acidic, sharp. Straight onto the tongue, fruity. You know, 
That's an A minus. Really easily. Apparently the sediment tastes nice, so I might make the bottle back when I filled up the glass. Oh, it's a great day. Oh wow, I'm having a great time here. This is a this is a little tinker this one. This is, this is really lively. Okay. Acid mosaic session IPA. 4.3% and unfiltered. And well Duncan here, he's a great lad he is. Um he knows his stuff, he's brewing, um oh so okay. You got oh, it's all hoppy. It's wonderful. That is sharp. And you get the fruity, hoppy mosaic. B plus plus. A lively B plus plus. Oh, wonderful finish as well. Oh wow. They're only extremely friendly here. They have wonderful beers and they wouldn't do experiment. Anyway, this is slightly more expensive than the last one. 9.5% <laughs> um, alcohol by volume. This is my last. I can't have to sleep all afternoon. As stouts go, this smells extremely hoppy. Sharp. Acidic, strong. It's a B plus plus. Huge finish. Oh wow! Yeah. 